Good evening, Daniel. How are you? Hello, mister. How are you today? Okay. Fine, here. Right here, waiting for everybody to connect. Yes. How's everything? A good day? So, so. so, so. Uh, yes. Relaxing at home? What, you? what? You are relaxing at home? Mm, no. Difficult one. Oh, really? Because, because my responsibility is the plan complex. Oh, my responsibilities. Responsibility. Responsibility. Yes, that's right. Oh, a hard day. Yes. Well, All day. Every day. All days, all sweet, all years. <laughs> okay. In that case, you should say every day. Every day, todos los días. Yes, exactly. Okay. El nervioso todo el año es all day, all years. Oh, no, <laughs> in that case, you need to say the whole year. Look. The whole year. The whole. The whole. The whole. Whole. The whole year. Perfect. Whole. Yes, the whole year. It means okay. the complete year. That's the meaning, the complete year. It is almost time for everybody to connect. I will remind them. Oh, there's Eliana Cordero. Eliana, let's see, let's see. Eliana is a new student. <laughs> My mm -hmm. Vicente, hello. María Iliana Corleto Velázquez. Hello, Iliana. Hola, buenas noches. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Great, great. Let me see. Buenas noches. Good evening. Good night. How are you, Cesar? 
Hello, I'm fine. Great, great, great. So let's see. Maria, could you turn on your camera, please? El IBE de activa me estaba abusada. Hello, hello. Let's see. Erika, I need your full name. Let's see. It is Erika Colocho. Erika del Carmen Colocho Cepeda. So, good evening. How are you guys? Let's see, there's Mayra Lisset. Mm -hmm. Jenny. Jenny Lisset Escobar. Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Very good. Thank you. Maybelline, good evening. Good evening. Una, una, una pregunta, teacher, antes de empezar. Yes, sir, sir. tell me. ¿Por qué, ¿Por qué se dice good evening y no good night? Uh, todavía no es tan tarde como para decir good night. Ok, guys, let's see, let's see, let's see. Hi, teacher. Hello, hello. Ok, well, we are going to start right now. Vamos a comenzar. Good evening, everybody. Uh, let's see, we got a new classmate today, Maria Eliana. Hello, how are you? My name is Douglas Arevalo. And today we are going to have a very nice class, a very interesting class, because we are going to continue with the verb be, but we are going to make it a little bit bigger. But before everything, we are going to make a small review from yesterday. Do you remember yesterday we were working with the verb be in the affirmative and negative form? And we were working with uh, like, um, I am Douglas Arevalo, I am 40 years old, I am Mariel. Do you remember that was yesterday? So let's see, Andres, please, as a practice, introduce yourself. Hi. Good evening. I am Andres Alberto Orellana Perez. I am 39 years old. I am from San Salvador. I, I am living in Antiguo Cujatlán. Perfect. Excellent. Cesar, what about you, please? Uh, hi, my name is Cesar Lopez. I, I am 34 years old. I'm from San Salvador. I am married. Okay. I'm engineering. An engineer. engineer. Perfect. Excellent. Let's see, let's see. Erica, please. Good night. Good evening, sorry. Okay, I am is Erika Colocho. I am 28 years old. I am living in Carmen, San Salvador. I am working in Indigo, El Salvador. I am married. Okay, perfect. Let's see, let's see Jenny Lisette Escobar, please. Hello. Hello. My name is Jenny. I am uh, I am from Ciudad Delgado. Perfect. I am married. Okay. I live in uh, Ciudad Delgado. 
Uh, I am mother. Okay, excellent. Mm, okay. That's enough. That's enough. Don't worry. Now let's see in the last one, the last one, el último del review. Uh, what about you, Jennifer? Good night. My name is Jennifer Elizabeth Dueso. I am um, a mother. Okay. I'm from Aguilar, San Salvador. I have, I, 26 years old. I am 26 I years am old. 26 years old. Perfect, excellent. So that was from yesterday, okay? Now I'm going to ask you something a little bit different. I'm going to ask you, what do you do? Do you remember that we were also looking at professions, at occupations? We were talking about uh, engineer, and we were talking also about secretary. What else do you remember? What other vocabulary we use? A truck driver. Truck driver, perfect. We got three now. We're missing three. Floor mm. manager. Floor manager, perfect. That's four. We're missing two. Supervisor. Supervisor, five. We're missing one. Mm. Maintenance. Maintenance. Maintenance, perfect, Andres. Maintenance. So remember, we were talking about truck driver, maintenance, supervisor, truck driver. All those words are related to occupations. People that perhaps in your company, some people with those occupations work. So let's see. Uh, in your case, Cesar, tell me. Tell me some of the position. You are an, an engineer, right? Yes. Okay, Cesar, you're an engineer. Tell me, please, uh, in your company, what other people are there? Are there drivers? Are there maintenance? Tell me at least two. Uh, there is sales assistant. Okay, salesperson? Uh, a manager okay a car driver okay drivers a, you can just say drivers drivers okay a excellent mechanics to me oh mechanics mechanic mechanics listen listen mechanics mechanics perfect okay. excellent okay what about you andres <laughs> The same. Uh, what about you in your case, Andres? Tell me, what do you do? I am a, a assessor sales. So, assessor de vendor. Okay. Could be a salesperson or a sales assistant. A sales assistant. A sales assistant. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Vicente is an architect. Am I right? Hello, Vicente. Can you hear me? Hello. What do you do, Vicente? What? When I ask the question, okay, listen, everybody. When I ask the question, what? do you do i am asking about your occupation or your profession okay okay so what do you do vicente i am architect okay do you work for a company what do you work for a company yes okay what's the name of your company Fruit gardening and design. Okay. So, oh, in your company there are gardeners? Yes. Okay, we got a new one, gardeners. What other people, what other occupations are there? Um, manager. Manager. Perfect. Um, what else? Truck driver. Truck driver. Very well. Um, no sé cómo se dice albañil. 
Mason. Mason. Yes, Mason. Is this yeah. word? Look, I'm going to send it to you right now. Mason. That's a. Um, that's an Albanian. Car yes. Carpenter. Carpenter. Carpenters. Okay, perfect. Yes. Thank you. Hello, okay. Carla. Welcome. Hello. Okay, Carla, tell me about your company. Uh, what's the name? Yeah, what is your, yeah, what is your company? Valdez. Valdez. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. What do you do? Eh, jefatura en almacén. ¿Cómo se diría en inglés? Storage chief. Logistic. En logística. Oh, logistics. That's logistics. Encargada de la logística de Valdés, de, de oh. almacén. Okay. Logistics. Logis. Logistics. Chief. Chief. Or it could be logistic storage. Chief. It could be logistics storage chief. I am logistic storage chief. Okay, now listen, listen. Everything was perfect, just listen. Storage. Storage. Ah, you're saying storage. And it is storage. Storage. Uh, the problem is Spanish. Sometimes it affects. Storage. Perfect, perfect, that's the way. Okay, guys. So let's see. Thank you, Carla. And oh well, 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 well. Tell me, what other people work with you? You're the chief. Okay. What's the people who works with you? I don't know. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Let's see. There's Julio. Julio. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Can you hear me, Julio? I think we got a little bit of problem because I cannot hear you, but well, let's see with somebody else. In this case, it's gonna help me. Let's see, Mr. Mm. Oh, Jennifer. Hello, Jennifer. Please activate your microphone, Jennifer. It's me. It's, I thought Jennifer. Okay, sorry. It was you. It was you. Jennifer was sorry. Okay. I am food safe, safety inspector. Okay. Yeah. What's the name of the company? Ingenio La Cabaña. Okay. So you are a sweet person. <laughs> yes. You work with sugar. Yes. Where, where is Ingenio La Cabaña? Where is it located? In the production is in El Paisinal. Okay. The office. The offices? Is in San Benito. Okay, listen. The offices are in San Benito. Are San Benito, yes. Be because it's not just one office, it's not just one person. There are many different people, yes. no? So yes. the offices, the offices, the offices are in San Benito. In San Benito, okay. So in your case, you work in El Paisnal or in San Benito? In El Paisnal. Oh, that's far. Yes, but uh, I live in Aguilares. So, so you travel. Yes, but it's little time. Okay. It's close. It's close. In that case, you say it is close. It is close. Yes, it means that it's close. In my case, for me, from where I live, donde yo vivo, it is far. In your case, it is close. Close. Okay. So we are talking about occupations. And tell me, Jennifer, what other people work with you? 
uh, electrical technician. Okay. Engineer, general service, mechan Me mechanics. Mechanic, a manager. Okay. Diverse occupation. Okay. Excellent. That's right. That's nice that everybody is like supporting different type of vocabulary. So let's see. And now, Erika Colocho. Hi. Um, I am working in assistant administrative. Okay. Um, in Indigo, El Salvador. Perfect. In, in call center. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. What other people were with you? Human resources. Human resources. Human. Human resources. Perfect. Uh, security. Security. Manager. Okay. Um, accountant. Accountants. Perfect. Um, man, mantenimiento. Maintenance. Maintenance. Um, uh, sales. Sales person. Sales, or sales person. People? Okay. Sales person. Um, engineer. 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 Okay, excellent. That's nice. So, as you have seen, we have talked about different types of occupations. But now we are going to like pass the page and work with something a little bit different. Okay. Yesterday, we, do you remember we made uh, small questions like, uh, what is your name? Are you married? Do you remember? We even had a small discussion about that. Okay. Now, yes, those are called in English, yes, no questions. Okay. Just no questions are used when we are talking about situations with where a simple answer, a short answer could suffice. Like uh, imagine that I ask uh, Jenny Lisette, Jenny, are you married? And she answers to me, yes, I am. Simple, no? Or Carla, let's see, Carla, I remember you have a son, don't you? So she's a mother and she says, yes. Now, in Spanish, we just say, yes, simple, short. Or we say, no. And that's it. Remember, yes, no questions are closed questions. They are closed. The answer can be either yes or no. Nothing else. Okay, in this case, we are not uh, asking for information. When we use yes, no questions, we are perhaps, uh, we need a yes, no answer, or we just need to confirm something that we almost remember. Like, I remember Andres, uh, you, are, you are single, no? Yes, he is single. He is not yes. married. You see? Yes, simple. In those situations, that's the case when we use the yes, no questions. As simple as that. Nothing complex. Now, yes, no questions in English are a little bit bigger than in Spanish. And in this case, today we are going to work with yes, no questions with verb be. With the verb be. Only with that. Okay? Now, uh, in order to make that, I will project to you a small PowerPoint presentation so you can check it out. And we are going to go slow in this topic, okay? Vamos a ir despacio en este tema because I want it to be clear, crystal 
clear, okay? Let's see, guys. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Right here. There we go. Okay, the objective for today, today's class, to know how to use yes, no questions and short answers. Okay, this is our objective for today. To know how to use yes, no questions and short answers. Now, in order to remember that, in order to know how to use yes, no questions, first I'm going to start like telling you or asking you some questions. Like, let's see. And right now I need to everybody, please turn on your microphones because I'm going to be like throwing questions all around. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, Carla, are you in your house right now? Yes. Okay. Nice. Is your son with you? Yes. It's somewhere around. <laughs> okay, good, good, excellent, excellent. Let's see. Uh, Jennifer, are you married? Yes. Okay, do you have kids? Yes, one. One kid. Uh, is it a boy or a girl? It's a girl. Oh, it's a girl. What's her name? Genesis. Genesis. Oh, beautiful name. Now, Thanks. let's see. Uh, Mabel and Janita. Hello. Hi, how are you today? How are you tonight? Good. Good, you're fine. And tell me, are you in your workplace in this moment? Or are you in your house? Your house. Okay. Uh, what about you, Cesar? Are you in your workplace? No. Are you in your house? Yes. Now, tell me, Cesar, because I don't hear no sound. Are you alone or with your family? Uh, my family. Oh, nice. So, my family. is your family in another room? Yes. Okay. So, are you in your bedroom? No. Are you in the living room? Uh, yes. Sala. Perfect. So if you see guys, I am throwing yes, no question. Marcos Martinez. Hello, mister. Thank you, Cesar. Thank you. Okay. Marcos, hello. Hello. How are you? Very good. Nice. Tell me, Marcos, uh, are you in your house right now? House. Okay. Uh, is it is it raining? Is it raining? No. It's not raining? No. Okay. And tell me, right now in this moment, is it hot or is fresh? Fresh. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, because I don't like the hot weather. So if you see, we are using yes, no question. Thank you, Marcus. I appreciate it. As you can see, we are using yes, no questions, and the answers are yes, no, yes, no. But that's a very informal way, and we need to also speak in a formal way. How do we speak in a formal way? Well, we're going to keep on watching a little bit of the presentation, okay? Give me a second.
Okay. Now, this is the way how we answer questions, okay? We say, uh, I tell you, uh, are you a student? And you tell me, yes, I am, or no, I am not. In this case, the, the answer must be long. It cannot be just yes or no. It has to be yes, I am, or no, I am not. Okay, let's focus just in this. Now, we're, we're gonna go step by step. Remember, when we are talking in English, uh, the short answer is not that short. En este caso decimos nosotros que la respuesta corta no es tan corta. Because in Spanish it is just a simple yes or a simple no. But in English it is yes, I am or no, I am not. Now, let's go back. Carla, please. Yes. Tell me, Carla, uh, is your name Carla Bolaños? Yes, I am. Yeah. Ah, listen. Is yes, your I name? am. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, perfect. Now, Carla, tell me, are you married? Yes, I am. Oh, you are married. Ah, no, no, I am not. <laughs> oh, perfect. She's not. She goes like, no way, no way. Okay, Carla. Tell me, uh, is your kid a boy? Yes, he's. He, he. Yes, he is. Okay, so you are a mother. Yes, I am. And tell me, Carla, are you a strict mother or are you a cool mom? <laughs> Strong. Oh, strong. You're very strict. Yes, I am. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you, Carla. Okay. Uh, Andres. Yes. Hello, Andres. And uh, tell me, are you Andres Alberto Orellana? Yes, yes. I am. Yes, I am. Ah, yes, I am. Tell me, Andres, uh, are you married? No. I am not. Oh, perfect. Uh, tell me, are you in your house in this moment? Yes, he's in my house. Yes, I am, or yes, I am in my house. Yes, I am in my house. Okay, thank you very much, Andres. Let's see. Uh, where is it, where is it? Vicente. Hello. Hello, Vicente. Tell me, uh, are you an architect? Yes, I am. Are you an engineer? No, I am not. Perfect. Uh, are you married? No, I am not. Okay, he says like, no way. You are like Carla that says, no, uh -uh, I don't want that. <laughs> okay, yes. okay, okay. Uh, are you a good student or are you a bad student, Vicente? Tell me, tell me, please. I am a good student. Oh, nice. Well, yeah, yes. you're, an, you're an architect. It takes time to do that. Yes. Uh, you must be very, very focused on details. It's like Cesar's. Because you have to be very, very focused on details. Nice. Excellent. Carlos Alberto. Thank you, Vicente. Carlos Alberto. Hello. Hello. Tell me, Carlos, uh, are you in your house right now? Yes. Are you married? I don't remember. Are you married? Yes, I am. Oh, perfect. And tell me, is your wife uh, Maria? Uh, no, no, no. No, she's not. 
No, she is not. Not? No, she is not. No, okay. she is not. Let's go back to the presentation. Thank you, guys. The rest of you, don't worry. We are going to, everybody is going to participate, but we go back to the presentation. Okay? And uh, okay. let's see. In the case of yes, you are, no, you are not. This is uh, a little bit more complex because this answer the questions, am I or are we? In the case when it is plural, remember that you are is used in singular and also in plural. Remember that. You are to utilize in singular and also in plural. In this case is tú, usted. In this case is ustedes. Okay? So, we are going to make a small practice about this. Let's see. Uh, Erika del Carmen Colocho. Hi. Tell me, Erika. Good. This is very important. Am I a good teacher? Say yes, please. I'm going to write. Did you get the question? Entendió la pregunta, Erika? No. Am I, soy yo, in my case, a good teacher? Yes, he. Uh, you are. Yes, you are. Perfect. Let's see. Uh, Ana Maria Palacios, hello. You're very quiet today. Oh. Ana Maria, tell me. Am I Meryl? Perdón. ¿Cómo es? La pregunta. Am I Meryl? Soy yo. Soy yo casado. What would be the answer? Yes. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Okay, perfect. <laughs> no problem, no problem, no problem. <laughs> Let's see, Mayra Lisset. Okay. okay. You remember me, no? Okay. Yesterday I was talking about myself. Tell me, Mayra. Am I am I 35 years old? I don't remember. Oh, come on, Mayra. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. Who remembers? Is that right? Am I 35 years old? Yes or no? No. Okay. No, you're not. Yes, you are correct, Cesar. I am 40. I am 40 years old, remember. Okay. Uh, let's see. Am I your teacher? Yes, you are. Perfect. You see, it's very simple. Very easy. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, guys. Uh, we are getting to know each other. So, let's see. Uh, Jennifer Hueso. Hello. Okay, do you know Mr. Cesar Humberto Lopez? No, I am not. I am Jennifer. No, but do you know Cesar? Conoce a Cesar? No. Is here? Is your classmate? Yes, but no, no trabajaba con él. <laughs> okay. Uh, but you have listened to the class. So tell me, Jennifer, is Cesar an architect? I don't know. Tell me. No, I no? He's an engineer. No. Oh, perfect. So you have to say no 
he's not. He's an engineer. Okay? He's an engineer. Your answer should be, no, he's not. He's an engineer. No, he's not. He's an engineer. Yes. Okay. No, he's not. He's an engineer. Guys, remember to turn on your cameras, please. Julio and Claudia. Okay, let's continue. Oh, there's, oh no, Jason. Never mind. Thank you, Julio. So, let's see, uh, Andres. Hi. Do you remember Carla Bolaños? Yes, I do. You remember her, perfect. Now tell me, is Carla single? Yes. Yes. She, she is. is. Perfect, excellent. Yes, she is. Okay, tell me, uh, is she 22 years old? No. She's no? Not. Oh, and Carla is like, no, I'm not. Yeah. Anyway, that's life. Okay, thank you, Andres. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Now, Jenny Lisette Escobar. Hello, Jenny. Hello. Okay, Jenny, you, do you know uh, Vicente? Do you remember Vicente Alexander? Uh, yes, I remember. Okay, tell me, is he an architect? Uh, yes, he is. Perfect. Yes, he is. Excellent. Tell me, is he married? Uh, no, he is married. No, he's not. No, he's not. Perfect. Excellent. Now, Marcos, everybody listen, please. Hello, Marcos, tell me, uh, how old are you? I am 40 years old. How old are you? Cuantos uh, años? 25 years old. Okay, 25 years old. Perfect. And tell me, are you married? I'm not. Oh, you are single. Perfect. Uh, that's it. Thank you. Now, let's see. Um, let's see, Carla. Oh, no, there's Julio. I'm sorry, Carla. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. There's Julio. Julio, tell me. Is Marcos 25 years old? Yes or no? No, he's not. He is 25. Ah, you were not listening. Yes, he is. And tell me, is he yes. is he married? <laughs> No, he's not. Perfect. Excellent. Now, let's go back to the presentation where we are going to see a little bit uh, more of the explanation, okay? Let me see. I'm going to share with you the presentation again. Oh, so we are working, remember, yes, he is. No, he's not. Yes, she is. No, she's not. Now we are going to work with yes, it is, and no, it is not. Okay? Yes, it is, and no, it is not. Okay. Now, let's see. Carla, now it's with you. I'm going to start with you. Tell me. Is it Friday today? No, it is not. Perfect. Uh, Jenny Lisette. Is it today a 
had they had candido? Yes or no? ¿A quién fue la pregunta? Jenny Lizette Escobar. It was okay. with you. <laughs> ¿Me la is repite? It, is it hot today? Eh, mm, no. No. It is not. It is not. Perfect. Andres. Hi. Is it uh, is it raining right now in your house? Uh, it is. It is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Pero oh, it's poquito, ¿cómo sería? Poquito, a little bit. A little, a little bit. A you say it like this. You say a little bit. Uh, a little bit. Yes, a little, little bit. bit. Okay. Entonces sería, uh, yes, it yes, it a is. Little bit. Okay. Uh, Two different answers. If you want to say just simple, yes, it is, yes, it is. If you want to be specific, you say, yes, it is. It is raining a little bit. That's a long answer. That's an explanation. Okay. Hey, where did Claudia go? She disconnect. Hmm, perhaps she had problems with the connection. Some people is going and coming. So let's see. It's like Carla. Carla, are you here? Oh yes, she's yes. here. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Now tell me, uh, Mr. Cesar Humberto. Is it, is it 8.45 right now? Eight, 8.45, I'm talking about the time. Ah, okay. Uh, no, it is not. No, it is not. not. It is. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, guys, let's see. And we go back to the presentation. But now we are going to go a little bit further in the presentation. Let me see. Okay, now we have, yes, we are, no, we are not. Yes, you are, no, you are not. Yes, they are, no, they are not. This is the same idea. Remember, in the case of he, she, or it, Remember, usually what we do here is we change it for the name of the person. Like, if you remember when I was in uh, somebody I asked, is Carla married? And somebody told me, no, she's not. And I asked, uh, is Vicente an architect? And somebody told me, yes, he is. Now, remember, when we are talking about the people, uh, what we do is this. We change the pronoun for a name, okay? We change the pronoun for a name. And let me just show you something. Okay, just give me a second. What I'm explaining, what I'm trying to explain here is that sometimes when we are talking about the persons, and yesterday I was explaining this, we don't keep on saying the name of the person because it will be like too complex to be doing that all the time. So what we do is that instead of saying the name, the given name of the person, we change and we use a personal we use the personal name of that person of self person and it's like this look 
And let's see, I got here a ah, whiteboard. Okay, let's see. Instead of saying uh, he all the time, I can say the name of the person. I can say Andres. I can say Ro I can say Robert. I can say Vicente. Okay. So instead of saying that, we instead of just saying he he he, we change and we say the name of the person. Yesterday I did the example. Like imagine that I'm talking about Andres. I'm talking to Jennifer, with Jennifer Weston. And we are talking about Andres, but I don't want to say a lot of time Andres, Andres, Andres. I say he, but right at the beginning of the conversation, it changes because you need to know who we are talking about. So in that situation, we use the name. Let's go back. So that means that when we are speaking, when we are talking to the people, uh, we use or the name or the pronoun and those are the personal pronouns okay so when we talk about the personal pronouns it's very important to remember them okay so let me see okay dokey so remember please when we talk about the personal pronouns when we talk about he okay he corresponds to a male can you see it or too small is this is this okay lo podemos ver bien yes yes okay perfect perfect excellent so remember the personal pronouns okay the personal pronouns they are i personal. you he she mm. it mm. we you again and they those are personal pronouns what is the function of the pronoun? Mm -hmm. The function of the pronoun is to substitute a name. Okay? Mm -hmm. That's why they are called pronouns. So they substitute the name of the person. Okay? So instead of saying Andres, Vicente, and me, I say we. Oui. Exactly. Instead of saying Andres and Vicente, I say they ellos. ellos instead of saying uh erica i said she sí, ella. exactly instead of saying marcos i say he sí. you see El. that's the function they fulfill okay they are used instead of so now, before we continue, I'm going to take the attendance. Let's see. Mr. Carlos Alberto Menendez. Present. Thank you. Mayra Eliana Corleto. Present. Thank you. Ana Maria Palacios. Present. Perfect. Maybelline Michelle Martinez. Mm, not here. Okay. Erika de Carmen Colocho. Present. Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso. Present. Jose Reinaldo Sandoval. Claudia Patricia Granados. Claudia, I saw Claudia around. Creo que la vi hace unos minutos por ahí. 
Ella estaba, ¿verdad? Sí, entró, pero después se salió, me imagino que el tráfico y llega a la tarde de los Ok, yeah. ¿Andrés Alberto? Present. Thank you. ¿César Humberto? No here. ¿Jenny Lisset Escobar? Present. Thank you. ¿José Ever Solís? No here. Creo que escribió al grupo que tuvo problemas de conexión. Ok, I, I haven't checked the, the, the WhatsApp group. Let's see. Yeah, he's having problems. Ok. Claudia Barahona is having problems. Ok, ok, ok. Now, let's see. And Vicente Alexander. Present. Perfect. Daniel Arturo. Present. Mayra Lisset Valladares. Present. You. Marcos Iván Martínez. Present. Thank you. Crisia Madeline. No. Mabel Ingenira. Present. Thank you, Maybelline. Present. Carla, Carla Ivonne. Present. Thank you. And Julio Alonso. Present. Perfect. Oops. Thank you, thank you. Now let's see, just give me a second that, well, when we do the next exercise, we are going to talk with these people. Now, so we are talking about yes, no questions, and we have been like discussing a lot. Now, guys, you are going to ask some questions to your classmates, okay? So the questions that we are going to work with are these. The questions must be just yes, no questions. Uh, the first question is going to be just are you and you are going to ask a name okay so if it is possible for you put it down are you like i'll do the example for you don't worry right now just take notice of the questions in this case what we are going to do is the name okay we're going to ask about the name we can ask the person with another name not necessarily with their own okay you're going to write like are you jose are you erica are you julio okay the second question is going to be are you meryl then you're going to ask are you again but in this case the question is going to be related to an occupation or a profession okay so are you and the name are you married are you the occupation then you're going to ask are you in your house okay so you're going to be asking four questions i'm going to divide you into groups and you're going to be asking each other all those four questions. And I will be moving from group to group for you to, for me to check how well you are doing, okay? So, are you ready? Okay, guys, the rooms are open for you.
María Eliana. Le ha aparecido en una esquinita por ahí una, una notificación de conectarse, join. Ah, ok. Eh, Jenny. Hola. Hello. Are you married? Yes, I am married. Are you married? Yes. Yes, I am. Okay. Are you occupation? Oh, in this case, I... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. In this case, it should be, are you a secretary? Or are you a doctor? Okay. Are you secretary? Yes, I am. No, no, I am not. No, I am not. No, I am not. Okay. Are you engineer? Engineer? Oh, are you an engineer? Are you Carla? No, I am not. Oh, Marcos. Perfect. Okay. Are you in your house? Yes, I am. Oh, yes, it is. Uh -huh. oh, no, yes, yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes. Okay. 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 Ahora pregunto yo. Okay. Está eh... preguntando, ¿tú eres Vicente o tú eres Carlos? Yeah. Are you, let's see, Mr. Reyes, Reyes Ramirez. Are you, Hello? are you Jose Reyes? No, I am not. Okay, are you Vicente Reyes? Yes, I am. Are you a doctor? No, I am not a doctor. Okay, are you an architect? Yes, I am. Perfect. Now continue. Follow the example. Okay, yes. Are you... Are you Andres? Yes, I am. Uh, are you married? No, I am not. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Are you truck driver? No. Are you I in your house? Not. Ah, okay. Are yes. you in your, are you yes, in your house? Am. Yes, I am. Okay. In my house. Haga usted las preguntas. Okay. You, you are. Are you? Oh, are you occupied? Occupied? Ah, in that case, yes. in that question, is this? Uh, let's see, Jennifer, are you a doctor? No, I am uh, not a doctor. Are you a supervisor? No, I am a supervisor. I am a safety, food safety inspector. Okay, thank you. You see, instead of saying the word occupation, you say one occupation. En lugar de decir la palabra occupation, usted pone una ocupación, un oh. oficio o un trabajo. Okay? Oh. Oh. Continue. Oh. Are you how? Yes, I am in my house. Okay, solo para contestar. Yes, I am. Oh, no, I Oh, no, I, I am not. Mm -hmm. Así sería solo para afirmativo o negativo. Una pregunta como, él es doctor, sería, is he a doctor? Oh, yes. Yes, Erika, he is, he is not. Yeah, it's like this, look, uh, let's see. Carla, tell me, is Marcos a doctor? No, he isn't. Okay. And 
Is Erika in her house? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Erika, is, is Carla in her house? Yes, he is. Carla? Yes, she is. Oh, perfect. Yes, she. Remember, he for a boy, she for a girl. Okay. Is Marcos in his house? Yes, he is. Is Marcos married? Uh, no, he's not. Oh, is he single? Yes, he is. Okay. Now, notice what I was explaining in the class. Instead of saying Marcos, 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 I changed Marcos and he. You can do that, okay? Continue, one more minute and then we're gonna go back to the main room, okay? Julio. Finish, guys. Are you architect. No, I'm not. Teacher, are you in your house? Yes. Yes, I am. Okay, ask me, ask me. Pregúnteme. Teacher, have you started other career? Uh, well, I have different occupations, actually. I am an English teacher. I am an electrician. I am a plumber. Do you know what is a plumber? Mm -hmm. No. Fontanero. No. Okay. Okay, so I'm an electrician. I am a plumber. Uh, let's see what else do I do. Oh, I install. I install ceilings. What? Ceiling what? Ceilings. Cielo falsos. Oh. Um, let me see what else. Oh, I got many different occupations, actually. <laughs> I mean, besides studying in the university, I was working in different things. So I learned different activities. Okay. Well, in one minute we go back, okay? Okay. Everybody's back right now. Let's see, almost. I got three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are still five in the breakout rooms. Let's see who's in the breakout room. Anyway, they are going to close very soon. Okie dokie. So, how was the practice? As far as I could tell, as far as I could listen, everybody was asking each other small questions. And it's something nice that I could hear was that some of you changed the idea, changed the, 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 the way in which the questions were asked. And that's perfect. Remember, it's very important for all of you to practice. It's very important for all of you. Whenever we go to the breakout rooms, you need to speak. Even if it's just two questions, you need to make them over and over because the idea is for you to learn them through repetition. Recordemos, la idea es aprender que se nos quede de memoria y lo lograremos a través de la repetición. Okay? Okay, guys. Now let's 
see, uh, let me see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to work. We're going to finish with the presentation right now. Okay, we're going to finish with the presentation, with the PowerPoint presentation. And then we are going to work with the manual. But right now, I am going to share with you a little bit more about the presentation. Okay. So let's see. Do you remember the questions? Am I a am I a doctor? Are you a student? Is she your friend? Some of you were already doing this type of questions. Is he or is she an accountant? Is it Monday today? Are we in class right now? Are they your classmates? Okay, these questions, please get them because we are going to work with these questions in the breakout room. So I need you to please get them. We are going to use them for the class right now. Okay. Are you getting the sentences? Ya tenemos las oraciones. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Okay. If not, I'm going to share it with you when we are divided in the breakout rooms. It's very important that we remember also the pronunciation. So listen to me. M I a, are you a student? Is she your friend? Is he an accountant? Is she an accountant? Is it Monday today? Are we in class right now? Are they your classmates? I repeat, am I a are you a student? Is she yeah. your friend? Is yeah. he an accountant? Yeah. Is, accountant? Is she an accountant? Is she an accountant? Is it Monday today? Is it Monday today? Are we in class right now? Are, are we in class, in class right, now? right now? Are they your classmates? Are they, are they your classmates? Okay. These questions, we are going to use them. We're going to use them a little bit further in the class. Okay? ¿Qué, qué es classmates? Compañeros de clase. Compañeros de clase. Ah, okay. Okay, perfect. Thank you. So, we are going to use those questions a little bit further. Vamos a utilizar esas preguntas un poquito más adelante. Let me see. According to my plan, right now it's 9-11, so we are going to use them now. Let's do that exercise now because you already got the pronunciation. Hagamos ahorita este ejercicio porque ya tenemos la pronunciación, okay? So, let's do it. Remember, what are you going to do? You are going to ask those questions to your classmate, okay? Usted le va a preguntar esa pregunta a su compañero and vice versa, okay? So you are going to be working in pairs right now because many questions, okay? It's going to be more personalized, one-to-one. -one. Okay, let's see. So I'm going to recreate all rooms. Okay, hold on. Okay, let me see what did I do? Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I made a mistake. I'm going to recreate. It's like this. Okay. 
Now let's go to the rooms. Hello, Jenny. Are you a student? Remember, you need to go to the rooms. Let me Hello. see who's on a sign. Ah. I got Ana Maria, Luis Alonso. Why don't you have a group? Okay, hold on. I'm going to recreate the breakout rooms. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I made a mistake with the breakout rooms. I'm going to create them again. I am so sorry. I made a mistake. Okay, so I'm going to create them all again because something here happened when I was creating them. And I got breakout rooms with no people in. Okay, let's see, everybody's here. We just need to wait 30 seconds for me to open them again. No, 12, 11, 10, five. Okay, 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 okay. Just give me a minute. I'm going to create them right now. Okay, now Peter, I can do it. Yes. Podría compartir las preguntas. Yeah, sure. I'm going to type it as a as a text to everybody. Okay? Don't worry. Okay. Now let me see. Uh, recreate automatically. It says that I got here three, six, nine, twelve, sixteen. Yes, sixteen participants, two participants per room. And let me see now. Now I got them ready, okay? Please join the rooms. Claudia, are you not in the rooms? I'm sorry, Claudia. Can you hear me? I think you are having problems to connect. Uh, Claudia Barona. Sí, he tenido bastantes problemas para poder conectarme y sale y por el espacio que, que no tengo ahorita y me ha costado. Okay, but... Entonces no he estado en toda la clase completa. Ok, pero ahorita le ha caído un mensaje para que se una a un breakout room. Si usted se une, va a trabajar con Andrés y yo me, voy, yo me uno en un segundito para ayudarle okay. y ponerle al día, ¿ok? Bueno.
live in in my house. Okay. Let me uh, Aura ask me the question. Are you a student? Yes, I am. Uh, no, you are not. You are not. Pero yo te pregunto, I am a doctor? Tú me contestas, no, you are not. No, you are not. Exacto, sí. Eh, por ejemplo, la otra pregunta, you, are you... Alive. Am I? Am I? Am I? Am I? Am I an accountant? An accountant. <laughs> okay. No worry, no worry. Is Maybelline your friend? No, she isn't. Ah, I will tell her. Yo le digo. <laughs> continue, continue. Is Cesar... Yeah. Are you on counter? Mm. Are you on account? Are you a counter? Uh, no, I'm not. It is Monday today? Mm. No, he's not. Are we in class right now? Mm, yes, we are. Are they your classmates? Yes, they are. Okay. okay. You don't know. I am Daniel. Am I? In, pardon. Am I uh, Daniel? Yes, I am. Are you a student? Yes, I am a student. Is she your friend? Friend? Are you Are they your classmates? Are they Ahí comenzaría la respuesta, si es, are there your class, classmates? Are they your classmates? It could be, I mean, right now it's just a practice. You can answer, yes, they are, or no, they aren't. Ah, ok, no. correct. Entonces, si sí, eso contestamos. Ok, perfect. Yes, they are, o oh, yes, No, they, are. they aren't. No, they, they. Yes, yes they, they are. are. Oh, no. Oh. You check on uh, a question. Uh -huh. Teacher. Yes, yes, tell me. Uh, uh, a question. En la primera pregunta, am uh -huh. I, am, eh, puede ser cualquier uh -huh. nombre, es el de ella o el mío. Yes, like, no, in my case, if I, if I am asking, I say, am I, am I Andrés Alberto? And what will be your answer? I no, am. no, you aren't because I tell you, am I Andres Alberto? And you tell me, no, you're not. Okay. Yo le estoy preguntando a Claudia, ¿es usted Andres Alberto? No. Am I? Soy yo. Soy yo. Ah, uh -huh. ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Am I Andres Alberto? Eh... Yes. So yeah, yes. He. Corregir ahí para que no tenga problemas. Ahí aparecen los tres puntitos. En la foto aparecen los tres puntitos. Y de ahí le da renombar o remember. Y ahí le puede cambiar su nombre para corregirlo. What is the problem with the name, María Ileana? 
que me pusieron María y soy Mayra. Oh, sorry. Let me see. Mayra y Liana. Yes, you're right. Don't worry. I will help you. Teacher. Mayra. Yes, mister, tell me. Eh, eh, ¿Dónde podemos tener nosotros eh, la información con la que usted tra está trabajando? Digamos, para seguir la, la, la secuencia y, por ejemplo, ahorita nos quedamos que no podíamos preguntar porque no teníamos las preguntas. Entonces... I, I texted them for you on the chat. Did you see the chat? ¿Vieron el chat? No. Eh, bueno, en el chat no aparece el texto o el que mandó ayer. No, las preguntas estas que vamos a usar en este momento. No, que no nos aparecen, teacher. No, no, Pero, yo no veo nada, teacher. Vea la sala. Está, está como solo. Ah, perdón. No, el chat de acá solo tienen las últimas que preguntamos. La de Are you, are you Marian? Are you in your house? Esa es la última que está en el, en el okay, chat. Ok, let me see, let me see. Let me see if I can share them with you right now. Y en la plataforma está esa información. It will be until tomorrow. Can you see it now? ¿La puede ver ahora? Yes. Yes. Ok, those are the questions. Ok, y la primera, ¿cómo se pronuncia, teacher? Am I? I am I? I am I? Yes. Am I? Am I? Yes. Y esa am le pregunta, I. le pregunta... Soy yo. Ok. Am I... Marcos Martínez, así sería. Yes, or I can say, look, am I a, am I a doctor? Ok. Y le contesta, no, I'm not. No, you are not. Mm, ok. Because I am asking you about me. Ok. 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 So, continue, guys, continue. Ok. Se cambió la pregunta, teacher. Ok, hold on. Ok, ahora sí. Eh, Mayra, are, are you a student? No, I'm not. I am a manicurist. No, I am not. Ok. Eh, is, she, is she your friend? No, no I am. No. I am. Uh, no, he is not. No, he is not. Uh -huh. Correct. Is it Monday today? Is it Monday? Yes. He, yes. Today? No, it today is not. Is Monday? No, it is not. Today is Tuesday. La pregunta es, ¿es ahora lunes? Uh, no. <laughs> no. no. No, it is not. No, it's not. Sí, la verdad que ahorita estoy perdida, ¿no? No, me, todavía no me... Okay, look. Listen. Listen to me. Eh, Vicente. Hello. Tell me, am I a doctor? No, I am. Uh -uh. No, I am not. No, you are. Remember. Look at the question. Okay. Am okay, I okay, a okay. doctor? Soy yo, le estoy preguntando. Ah, ok, ok, ok. And you tell me, no, you are not. No, you are not, yes. Ok. Are you a student? Yes, I am. Ok. Is, she, is Ana María your friend? 
Yes, she is. Is she an accountant? Not remember, but ask where. Ana Maria, are you an accountant? Not. Okay, perfect. Tell me, Vicente, is it Monday today? No, it is not. Perfect. It is Tuesday. Excellent. Are we in class right now? Yes, we are. Okay. Are they your classmates? Yes, they are. Excellent. Okay. Now I'm going to leave you for a second, guys. Conté que iba a empezar clases en inglés y me empezaron a escribir en inglés. Oh, that's good. <laughs> it is excellent. It's a better practice for you. So, Julio, yeah. tell me, are you a student? Yes, I am a student. Is it Monday today? No, it's Thursday. Okay. Tell me, is Jennifer your friend? He says, no. no uh, oh, Jennifer. <laughs> excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, we're going to no, go. No, she's not my friend. <laughs> we're going to go back to the main room, okay? Hello, Carla. ¿Practicamos tú y yo o...? Ya nos están uniendo a todos. Ah, ok. Sí. Sorry, Carla, hello, we can practice, no problem. Tell me, Carla, am I Marcos Iván? Okay, okay. Um, Marcos. Marcos. Hi. And am um, I a secretary? No. You are, aren't. No, you aren't. Oh, no, you are not. No, you are not. Okay, let's see. And tell me. Let's see, Carla. Tell me, are you a student? Yes, I am. Okay, now let's see. Carla, tell me. Is Jennifer your friend? Yes, he is. Yes, she is. Yes, ah, she is. Okay, now Jennifer. Hello. I got a question for you. Tell me, Jennifer. Uh, is Andres an accountant? I don't know. <laughs> Ask him, please. Andres. Andres. Hi, Jennifer. Hi. Are you a content? No, I am not a content. You are engineer, right? No, I am not. Wrong person. Engineer. Cesar is the engineer. Okay. No problem. As you can see, with very simple questions, we can start making conversations because we are giving and receiving answers about some personal questions, okay? And it's very important that you realize that step by step, you are building up this knowledge to make bigger questions. And it's important for you to practice. Now, I'm going to make a pause here. Voy a hacer una pequeña pausa. This 
¿Sí, eh, ¿Se ha conectado a la plataforma? Sí. Ya eh, se yes, teacher. Ok. Yes. Recuérdense que tenemos que hacer las tareas y aparece okay. una tarea después de cada... Está la sección, dice videoconferencia, luego dice tarea, luego videoconferencia, luego tarea. Pero también abajo de la videoconferencia, hoy por la mañana subieron ya el video de la clase de ayer. Y abajo del video les aparece ahí el who are you. Yo les puse una preguntita, ¿verdad? Yes. ¿Quiénes, ¿Quiénes me la han contestado? Ay. Ok. Les pregunto porque yo el día de mañana voy a tomarme el tiempo de revisar esas preguntitas y las que necesiten corrección, I will correct them. Ok. So that's okay. going to be our writing practice. Esa va a ser nuestra práctica de escritura. The exercises that appear in the, tarry, in the homework, los ejercicios que aparecen en el homework, que solamente ustedes van marcando ahí cuál es la correcta y la incorrecta, if you don't get them right, you can repeat them. The idea is for you to get them right at the end, ¿ok? Puedes repetir ese ejercicio para que quede bien. Porque la idea es que lo hagamos hasta que nos quede perfecto. That way you practice and that way you learn. De esa manera practicamos y de esa manera aprendemos. Ok, now let's continue. Teacher, I have a question. Yes, uh, Daniel first and then I don't remember who. That, tell me, Daniel. Yes, yes. Um, the use am um, and I. The use. Um, and my. Uh, the exercise. Ok, ok. Homework one, homework one. Homework um, one. La plataforma. Yes, let's see. Vamos a utilizar el, vamos a utilizar el an y el a. El I. You are talking about homework one. I am. El, porque estaba haciendo ejercicio y me confundí en el a y am. Para... Oh, 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 oh. Yes, I remember, I remember. Yes, you are talking about a or an. Yes. Yes. Cuando utilizar a y cuando utilizar a. Okay, hold on, hold on a second. It's very simple. You mean this? Uh, hold on. You mean a or the use of an? Yes. Yes, yes. Okay. Look, a car. A house, uh, a doctor. Now, if you can see this word, a is used before a consonant. And, okay, look, an ant, una hormiga, before a vowel. Look, an idea. Antes de consonante, a. Antes de vocal, an. Was that your question? Very simple, no? It's very simple. Okay, perfect. Now, guys, we are going to work a little bit with the manual because we need to work. Let me see if I'm not mistaken. Yes, uh, according to the plan, we are going to work on pages 13 and 14. So I'm going to share with you the manual. Let's see right now. And to go to page 13. Okay. This conversation, just listen to the, to the pronunciation, okay? Hello, I am Ana Trujillo. Hi, Ana. I'm Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me. Is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She is Mrs. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay, and are you the supervisor? No, I am not. I am a salesperson. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. I repeat. Hello, 
Hi, I'm Anna Trujillo. Hi, Anna. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice to, meet to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me. Excuse me. Is she Miss Diana Andrade? Miss Diana Andrade. Diana Andrade. Okay, now everybody, please just stop a second. Listen, listen. Something important. Can you see here? Mr. 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 is used for male, for men. You use Mr. It means Señor. Okay. Like in the case here that I got, uh, let me see. I got Mr. Marcos Ivan Martinez. I got, listen to this. He is Mr. Martinez. He is Mr. Marcos Martinez. But in English, you cannot say he is Mr. Marcos, okay? That's different from Spanish. And now I will explain that. Listen again. I got here a uh, Miss, Miss, just. Miss. We got Miss, like, uh, we got Miss. Carla Bolaños. I use Miss. I use this Miss. When uh, hold on. Why do I have it here? Say chat to everyone. Okay, I got Miss. You see, it? that one is used for every for the ladies. When I do not know if they are single or married. Ese se utiliza con las chicas cuando yo no sé si son solteras o casadas. So, and that's why it is pronounced Miss, like uh, Miss Bolaños. And then she, say, she tells me, oh, Mrs. Señora or Miss Señorita. Mrs. Mrs. M R S, Mrs. 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 That's Senora. Okay? And we have Miss Senorita. So for ladies, there are three different. We got Miss, the first one, Miss, when we don't know. Ese es cuando no sabemos. Si es soltera o casada. Mrs. Señora. Miss Señorita. And remember, always in English, estos son títulos. Y el título de señora, señorita, o lo que nosotros decimos como señor, eh, van con el nombre completo o con el apellido. Never con el primer nombre. O sea que yo no puedo decir eh, Miss Claudia, Miss Carla, that's not correct. I cannot say Miss Erika or Miss Jenny or Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Erika. I cannot say Mrs. Jennifer. I cannot say that. I need to say it with the full name or with the last name. Lo digo con todo el nombre o con el apellido. So Mr. Andres Alberto Orellana can be Mr. Andres Orellana or Mr. Orellana. But never Mr. Andres. That is not correct. Okay? Is that clear? Yes. Yes. Okay, perfect. Let's go back. Okay. Questions about the vocabulary here? We got supervisor, salesperson. I think we get that. Okay, now from the conversation, we have two questions. Is Mrs. Diana Aguilar the manager of the company? Andres, is she? Yes or no? Yes. Do you remember? Is Mrs. Diana Aguilar the manager of the company? Yes, she is. 
Oh, yes, oh, yeah. she is. Look, Carlos says he is. She is Mrs. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. The second question. Are Ana and Carlos supervisors? Yes or no? No, they aren't. Are they supervisors? Son supervisores? No, no they aren't. No, they aren't. Look, because Carlos is a salesperson. You see? Carlos is a salesperson. He is not a supervisor. Now, this is what we are we have been working with. Remember? Yes, no question. Are you Carlos? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is she a manager? Hello. Okay. Listen. Just listen, please. Are you Carlos? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is she a manager? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Oh, no, she's not. Is he a supervisor? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Oh, no, he's not. Are you colleagues? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. No, we're not. Are they service providers? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. No, they're not. Are your bosses here? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. No, they're not. Now, guys, questions about this? No questions? Perfect. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Now I got questions for you. Let's start with, uh, let's see, Andres Alberto Orellana. Hello, mister. Can you hear me? Hi, teacher. Yes. Okay, tell me. Is she Jessica? Number one. Okay. We are in page 14. Is uh, the, the first question. Yeah. Exercise five, yes, first question. Is she Jessica? No. It says no. No, she, no. No, it's not. No, she's not. No, she's not. She is Linda. Perfect. Thank you. Now, let's see. Erika del Carmen Colocho, exercise two. Um, he is a manager. Look at, the quest, look at the answer. I. So the question must be with you. Are you... Are you a manager? Are you a manager? Yes, I am. Perfect. Number three goes to, let's see, Cesar. Okay. Is he Thomas? No, he isn't. He uh -huh. is Jose. Perfect. Excellent. Now, let's see, we got two more. Let's see, let's see. Um, Jenny, Jenny Lisette. Number four. Are they Francisco and Alan? Uh, yes, they are. Perfect, excellent. Carla, number five. Are you Marcela and Carla? No, we aren't. Mm -hmm. We are Maria uh -huh. and Perfect. Excellent, guys. 
So you see, the exercise is very simple. Okay. Now, uh, the rest of the exercise, we are not going to do it because it's mostly what we did in the... It is what we did in the breakout rooms, okay? The rest of the exercise, there's no need because it's what we were working in the breakout rooms. It was just a small conversation. Now, let's see, just need to check if this person appeared. Maybelline Michelle couldn't connect, no? No, she couldn't. So, and Jen, let's see, Jose Reinaldo, either. Cesar Humberto Lopez, not present. Jose Ever. He, he is. Present, present. Cesar. Cesar, Cesar Humberto Lopez. I'm sorry, <laughs> mister. He, he is. Okay, okay. I let's, am, I am. I am do Cesar. It, let's do it correctly. Let's do it correctly. Carlos Alberto Menendez. Present. Present. Uh, Mayra Eliana Corleto. Present. Thank you. Ana Maria Palacios. Present. Uh, Maybelline Michelle Martinez de Ramos. No. Okay. Erika de Carmen Colocho. Present. Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso. Present. José Reinaldo Sandoval. No, here. Uh, Claudia Patricia Granados. Hmm. Acaba de estar acá. And she's having problem with connection. Okay, Andrés Alberto Orellana. Present. Cesar Humberto López. Present again. Thank you, Cesar. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But it's good that you are like paying attention. Jenny Lisette. Present. Eh, José Ever Solís. José Ever no se conectó, ¿verdad? No, no at all. Ok, zero. Eh, Vicente Alexander. Present. Thank you. Daniel Arturo. Daniel Arturo, hello. Can you say present, please? Present. Thank you. Mayra Lisset Valladares. Present. Thank you. Marcos Ivan Martinez. I saw Marcos present. somewhere. Thank you, yes. Crisia Madeline Herrera. No. Maybelline Janina. Present. Thank you. Carla Yvonne. Yes, I'm here. Carla says, yeah, yeah, still alive, still alive. <laughs> cool, that's great, that's great, excellent. Carla goes like, yeah. And Julio Alonso? Julio, I saw Julio. Let's see, Julio Alonso Durán. He was somewhere. Él estaba por aquí. Okay, let's see. It's almost time, but it's not time. Estamos casi en el momento, but not yet. Okay, now let's see. Everybody, please open your mics because I'm going to be asking. I'm going to be having a conversation with everybody. Abramos los micrófonos. Voy a estar hablando con todos. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to be throwing random questions. Okay, let's see. Carla, tell me. Are you a student? Yes, I am. Okay. Are you a good student? Are you a good student? Yes, I am. Mm, I don't believe you that much, but anyway. Okay, okay. Let's see. Jenny Lisette. Hello, Jenny. Hello. Tell me, are you 40 years old? Uh, yes, I am. Okay, nice. And uh, let's see. 
Daniel Arturo. Yes. Are you, listen, are you sleepy? Yes, I am. Oh, he's like, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Andres, are you tired today? Are you tired? No, I'm not. Oh, cool. Nice. Okay, tell me. Uh, Marcos, Marcos Ivan. Yes. Okay, I got a good one for you. Now, tell me. Are you... Uh, Comfortable? Yes, yes. Hey, he's yeah. in the fresh, he's like relaxed. Yes, okay. relaxed. Cool. Excellent. <laughs> Mayra said, tell me. I don't see you. Tell me, are you smiling? Yes, I am. Okay, cool. A very smiling <laughs> person. Okay, Vicente. Hello. Vicente Alexander, tell me, are your are your dogs around? Yes, they are. Okay, he got his four dogs. Oh. Yes. Okay, nice. Okay, let's see. Cesar. Cesar, do you have a son or a daughter? A uh, daughter. Okay. Is your daughter asleep already? Uh, yes, she she's. Oh, that's good. She's asleep. That's nice. Okay. And tell me, is your daughter five years old? Cesar, is your daughter five years old? Uh, no, she is not. Okay. How old is she? Uh, she has seven she years. Is, she is. She is. She is. She is seven, seven years. years. Perfect. Excellent. Mr. Carlos Alberto. Hello. Tell me, Carlos, uh, are you alone in your house? Do you know that word? Are you alone? Alone. Yes, it means solo. Uh, Are you alone in your house? Uh, not. No, no I, uh, I am not. Not, I am not. Okay, Erika del Carmen. Colocho, tell me, are you married? Yes, I am. Okay, Erika, is your husband around? Um, no, um, he's no, I need to trabajar Oh, no, he's not. No, he's not. Okay, you can say he is at work. You can say he is at work. He's at work. Oh, he is working. Oh, man. Heavy schedule. Honduro horario. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Ana Maria Palacios. Ana Maria, Hello. are you Mario? Are you? Are you Mario? Uh, I am not. Oh, you are not Mario. Ah, uh -huh. interesting. <laughs> And tell me, uh, are you alone in your house, Ana Maria? Perdón? Are you alone in your house? Uh, Está sola? I, 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 ¿En casa? Um, no, you got kids, no? Tiene hijo, perdón? Uh, yes, yes. Yes, I remember. So the answer would be, no, I am not. I am not. Uh -huh. Okay. Mabel and Janira. Hi, Dick. Okay, tell me, Mabel, uh, is Carla your classmate? 
Yes, yes, she is. Okay. Working okay. together. Oh, is she a good classmate? Or not that it's... good? Yes. Oh, come on, Carla. I was asking maybe, not yes. you, Carla. <laughs> yes, good. Yes. Good. Okay. Well, she actually... She Actually, yeah, everybody she has... is good. She is good. She okay. is my, my boss. Oh, really? So yes. you are like, that's why Carla is like very serious. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> that's nice. So, guys, uh, believe it or not, we are in the nick of time. Crean o no, llegamos a la hora. Uh, before we leave, Thank you very much to all of you. Eh, gracias a todos. Tratemos de conectarnos. Si conocemos a alguno de los compañeros que no se ha conectado, tenemos contacto con alguno, puede ser que sean de su misma empresa, avísenles. Creo que de Valdés tengo como cuatro, ¿verdad? ¿Cuatro o cinco? Si conocemos a alguien, me le avisan porque... Eh, it's a problem. So, Right now, uh, thank you very much. Tomorrow, mañana temprano, suben el video la gente de la empresa, de la compañía. Les voy a poner otra notita ahí en el foro. Participemos en el foro, en las tareas. La podemos realizar de nuevo. Cualquier pregunta, por favor. Yo estoy acá siempre conectado. Me preguntan, o, este, me preguntan en el foro, please. Okay. Okay. But I am there all the time, so you can ask me. Thank you very much. Have a good night. Take care. Good See you night. tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Be on time. Bye. Be on time. Thank you. Bye. Thanks to you. Bye. See you later. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.